What is up guys, Tony Tone back again with another review. So today I'm going to be reviewing another variety of Mrs. Thinster's Cookie Thins. This is the chocolate chip variety. And like I said in the other re review I did of these, of the cake batter variety, these are kind of like an answer to, I guess, the uh, Keebler Cookie Thins. If I can ever get this darn thing open. There we go. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, these are just really thin, crunchy chocolate chip cookies. Mmm, smells good. So, let's give it a bite. Yep, that's a thin and crispy chocolate chip cookie. They kind of remind me of, like, a, like a crispier version of Famous Amos, almost. Has the same kind of vanilla flavor to it. Same crispiness, bittersweet dark chocolate. Yeah, I'm not sure what kind of chocolate, but it tastes exactly like the chocolate chips they use in Famous Amos. Let's see here, enriched flour, uh, nice and reduced iron thiamine mono, mononitrate, bunch of other chemicals. <laughs> um, Brown cane sugar, butter, chocolate chip, unsweetened chocolate, uh, cocoa, cocoa butter, sorry. Uh, let's see, eggs, natural vanilla flavor, salt, whey baking soda. Or sorry, whey and baking soda. There's no such thing as whey baking soda. Uh, it says contains wheat, milk, soy, and eggs. Let's give it one more bite and I'll rate it for you. Okay, so for the Mrs. Thinster's Cookie Thins chocolate chip, I'm going to give it another three. They're not amazing, but in a pinch, if you need something chocolatey or a cookie, these will do. And per serving, they're only 130 calories for five cookies, so that's not terrible. But uh, yeah, so if you've had these, let me know what you thought of them in the comments below. Give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Share it so someone else can see it. And subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next review. Peace.